get it because your hitbox is still extended. Yeah. It also looks like they made it easier to turn around up be out of shield too. If I don't recall correctly, you might have had to jump cancel. Either way, good stuff to gaming 3-0 there. It looked like he was gonna lose that last one for sure, but he brought it back. So we and, uh, personal, man. Never yeah. underestimate it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right about that. But now I'm kind of like, dude, if this guy could beat Sonic with Luigi, then maybe he just... Well, this guy is going through like, all the terrible matches. And whatever matchup that Gale wants to throw down. Could be Spit, could be um, Hero. He's got a Cloud and a Sonic. So who knows what Gale has in store. But well, first he's got to get through Sonic from Tony Tank. Wait, is it Z tank or Z tank? It's Z tank. Okay, no, I was like, Z wait, hold up, is he still stuck? Oh, wait, why did you? I think you could have just back there, but it's okay. Uh oh, he got grabbed. There we go. Oh, that was very, very unoptimal combo there. I think he should have just gone for the damage instead of like, you no, know, I, I don't know. He knew that that upbeat wasn't gonna be there, I think. Edgeguard? Oh. No. I think he's gonna have to force. Alright, he got the air dodge though, that's fine. Yeah. Dang. Looks like Tony isn't uh super super good at punching the side B off stage. Maybe he doesn't play that many Sonic, movies. What can Sonic do really besides drop the spring? You can drop down with the back air, but then you're you know that's a little bit more dangerous than just dropping the spring. Yeah, it's mainly just a timing thing. Like, you time the back air right when the side B is uh, over, pretty much. So you don't run the risk of trading. And if you do trade, you have to trade with it when it's really far off stage, so you can make it. Nice. Don't force the side B again. Yeah, again, nice. But this time, yeah, that was taking that was the a, hit. Yeah, yeah, that was a fair trade to get go for. Oh, bad spin dash though. Yeah, he got. I think he did the one where it has a little bit of lag after shield, so he got air smashed. Damn, that combo is clean. That was a decent amount of percent for a Sonic combo too. And, uh, spin dash into like jump attack and then homing attack after. <laughs> yeah. And the back air. Attack from the back three different. Too. So this matchup was really bad for Luigi for when Sonic had canceled Spin Dash with Shield. Because like he just never had to approach with Spin Dash, but now he kinda Oh no way, are you serious? Are you serious, man? Yeah. Hey, wait, robbery. That's a that's a tilt for sure. But hopefully he doesn't let that get He can still take this stock without getting a percent. Uh, good recovery. Oh, bad tech, though. Or lack of tech, rather. I mean, that was just good reads from Tony, too. Because he realized that gaming used his air dodge early. So, really, the only defensive tools he, that gaming would have access to was the down B. Yeah. Which won't work if you're above him. Like, in this game, Luigi has to, like, use every resource he can just to get back to the stage once he gets knocked far enough. Uh oh. Oh, I thought he was going to go for the down, or the, uh, up -y. I think he was going to, but there was a good DI mix-up from Tony, because most people would DI that out, and you could see that gaming was ready for the for that DI. Wait, why would he... Uh... What? Huh. Okay. Well, uh, first game going to Tony. We'll take it. Damn. I don't know what happened to gaming at all there. But... Yeah, well, maybe, maybe, uh... <laughs> maybe Wi-Fi is not on this. That's for sure. Ready? Where did, uh... Where did he take him? Did he go back? Yeah. I'm doing it. Stage wasn't that bad. He just 
screwed up big time. I wonder if Luigi can, uh, oh yeah, he can. I was gonna say, can he just use, like, his grab to clink with the spin dash, and then just grab him out of it? <laughs> hey, can he there? Which yeah. stop, uh, Sonic in his place. You can also use Fireball. If, uh, he has to be, like, a specific hit of spin dash, though. Otherwise, spin dash just goes right through it. Oh, nice, Cyclones. It looks like Gaming is just trying to find his moves that he can interrupt spin. No, no. wait, no. Nate, why? So the score is 1 1 now. Yeah. It's, uh... Alright, Gaming. The score even. Maybe we'll get to watch this one. Didn't you say Gaming is from SoCal? Yeah, he is. He's from A18. Yeah, that, that I already actually a lot. has gone to, he's gone to tournaments before, like, one of the A18 tournaments. Oh, he died to misfire again. Damn. Can you believe getting, like, can you imagine getting killed by misfire twice in one set? That's, a, that's enough to make that someone like a <laughs> Oh, wait, he got grabbed. Oh, right, he's actually not getting combo that hard. I wonder if he knows how to DI it. I guess he would have to know how to DI it down. Because Gaming keeps missing the spike down there. I mean, he's still at 75, but like, oh, never mind. He got a DI shield. Not, yeah, not there. It touching the shield, we're going to have a bad time. Oof. Wow, yeah, that Zare is so good at stopping the spin dash. Uh oh. Oh, but okay, good, good mash. mash. Good yeah, mash. He mashed for his entire existence. Like, he did not die. You know, I, I gotta hand it to oh Gaming, though. God, like, that was just great dead. pressure at on that platform. Did you see, like, at the start of the stock, like, he. He rolled an up B, reset on the ledge, and then continued to pressure on the platform. Yeah, that was that was pretty smart. But dang, I didn't expect Sonic to die that early to F Smash. And now this is the rough stuff for Sonic, because he struggles to kill and he's down by two stocks. Like <laughs> gaming doesn't even have to really go in anymore. He's still going in, because like look how much damage he's getting, but I mean it's it's not even like exactly him going in. He's stopping the approach of Tony with fireballs and Zare, grabbing, and then just doing the Ouija down. Yeah, that's that's true, that's true. Oh nice, nice that's nice. Okay, force him to use most of his invincibility, yeah. Use the spring. Pretty smart stuff. Uh oh. Okay, some Tony's gotta be careful. He keeps going for homie attack and uh Gaming knows how to deal with it. He's either just like punishing like spot dodging and punishing or just like hitting it out of it. And uh, yeah, next time I think he does a bad homie attack, he might just die. Wow, this guy really... <laughs> this guy's like, hey, how about a third misfire? Yeah, that was literally just like putting fear in Tony, like, yo, you got some flashbacks? Remember this one? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Tony needs an edge guard, if I'm being honest. But he needs like an early gaming kill. Gaming off stage off is hard enough as it is. Yeah, it's hard yeah, though. Yeah, it's hard if look, gaming's his, his, feet are planted. His spin dash keeps getting canceled out. Okay, good homing attack. Gonna mess up the timing on that up smash too. Free punish? Yeah. Why is Sonic's like arm extend by like a mile every time he does up smash? Wait, did you get an edge guard here? He did, but uh, gaming saved the jump. Yeah, he saved the jump, and he didn't believe in getting the back air to beat up the side B. I don't blame him though. Last time he messed that up, he like almost died. Oh, drop the spin dash confirm. Crank putting Tony back at the ledge. Did that Cyclone have intangibility so that F Smash didn't do anything there? That's what it looked like. I can't tell it though. Like, because Either way. <laughs> I just scooped up that wind up. Took the game. 2 1 gaming.
Gotta say, I'm impressed. This is a bad matchup for Luigi, I think. <coughs> but then again, oh, sorry. Then again, um, the matchup is bad when the Sonic is able to just like camp out Luigi. But I haven't really seen Tony really able to use that strategy. Honestly, because it's been behind by so much. Yeah, um, but I mean, now Tony's playing a little bit more defensive. Typically, we've seen Tony playing um, more aggro, trying to cross up with spin attack, spin dashes, and then you know, get the, the mix up follow up. But game four seems like a completely different story. Yeah, this is the best start he's had so far. And this is a good stage to do it too, because like when the platforms are gone, basically FD, and then when the platforms are there, he can just run away to those platforms very easily if he wants to. Like, saw how, well, he didn't go to the platform there, but he saw how he went full screen with the spin dash and like got all the way to the other side of the stage. Okay, nice. Early side B? Misfire. Nice, nice kiss with there. Oh, he got a There's the misfire. Oh, oh man. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, man. I mean, RNG saves your butt, right? <laughs> okay, but nice. We got the episode to kill anyway. Only taking 51. That's good stuff. The approach is going to get stuffed out by the Luigi Cyclone. Oh, he died. Oh, he died so early because he did a laggy back air on stage. Oh man, combo oh, yeah, big, big big too. combo. Big Even combo. reading the directional air dodge. It's rough, man. I feel like Tony should have ran away with that lead. I feel like he went way too aggressive when he had no reason to. Now he's down. I did say, like, typically we've seen Tony play more offensive and aggressive than um, passive. And yeah. He's really coming back to bite him. Yeah, it might just be his play style, you know? Like, that's how he likes to play. But at least he's not dead yet. He can still get the stock first. Play his card rate. Yeah. Uh, side phone, but careful with that DI. I didn't look like it was DI properly. Okay, you should see the problem is the spin dash out of there. Opportunity? Oh, there, there, but he's fine. Nice. Snuck in that force smash. Caught. Gaming reaching a little bit too heavily, but dang, he's just gonna die to Luigi dash tap because that's a kill move for some reason in this game. The funniest kill move in the game, too, because he literally just like pushes you off the stage. He's just flailing his arms. Uh oh. Not okay, luckily, the, luckily for him, he D had the second down here. Well, but oh, he's still getting comboed pretty bad here. Yeah, it looks like Tony's been DIing up and in uh, because he's been going straight up on those down throws. But gaming still expects for him to DI out. Hey, Tony with a slight lead here. He's a job breaking his back. Oh, he just keeps hitting these spin dash combos. This is racking up so much good for Simpering, but I, I don't know, man. That would be the kill, too. Uh -oh. Here we go, down throw. Oh, the tornado! Oh, he follow up in the so bad DI! No! Uh, he DI'd in on the Cyclone. That's so rough. But oh, it's looking like a good game for Tony. Gaming finds the grab. Takes that game right there. 3-1.